Hello everybody, I am 22 Tiger Dude and I am here to review The Lone Ranger starring Army Hammer Johnny Depp. Army Hammer first, Johnny Depp second. Helena Bonham Carter, William Fitchner, Tom Wilkinson, Ruth Wilson, and Barry Pepper. Going into this film, you all knew that I was excited for this film. The plot is about when Tonto tells his little boy a story about how John Reed came from the man of the law to the hero of justice, aka the Lone Ranger. Coming out of the Lone Ranger, I was disappointed. The Lone Ranger, overall, I think is an okay film, but Coming out of it, it was, it was, it really was not what I hoped for, you guys. And I'm sorry to say that, and I'm pretty sure this movie is going to get a lot of hate. And trust me, I understand why a lot of people are going to hate this film. Sure, there's going to be some that like it, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be most that hate this film. I'll start off with the positives. When the film had action sequences, when there were action scenes actually in the film. It was cool. It was a lot of fun. It had me smiling a little. Some of the jokes in this film were pretty good overall. I would either chuckle or laugh at a joke, at certain jokes. I thought Johnny Depp was pretty good. He was alright as Tonto. He is basically the Indian version of Jack Sparrow. I, I know a lot of people are gonna say that, but he really is like that, so his character really is no different. I do enjoy his makeup though, and he can be enjoyable in certain moments. I also like that this film actually played the classic Lone Ranger song from the Lone Ranger TV show. I've seen a few episodes of the Lone Ranger TV show, and I really enjoy them. Unfortunately, this movie is so different from the TV show. The TV show is all about being serious. This movie, it tries to be all goofy. And this is where I am going to get to my negatives with this film. I thought Army Hammer was terrible. Terrible as the Lone Ranger. I don't blame it on him. I blame it on the script and the writers in charge of it. Plus the direction of Gore Verbinski also. But I do not blame it on Army Hammer. I just didn't buy him and how his character was developed. It... It felt lazy. Johnny Depp, he was alright here, but he was getting a little annoying at times. There was also this little back and forth where it would go back to old Tonto and this little boy. Because old Tonto is telling the story of John Reed and it would go back and forth. It got a little annoying after a while and I was kind of like, okay, get back to the movie. Even though I was getting taken out of the movie, I still wanted to see where the story was going to continue either way, whether I was interested or not. Most of the humor in this movie, the movie is just too over the top. It's too far-fetched. There was some really noticeable choppy editing in this film and it just really distracted me. Storyline to this movie, it was very lackluster. It's nothing special at all. There are certain aspects to the storyline I may have enjoyed with the whole the time watch and we get a little backstory of Tonto which was a little sad and that was one of the parts of the film I enjoyed. I didn't enjoy the Lone Ranger and Tonto's chemistry. The whole film, they didn't like each other. Another positive I have is Helena Bonham Carter. Even though she's only in like three scenes of this film, I thought she was really enjoyable, to be honest. I actually thought Helena Bonham Carter was very attractive and super hot in this film. I liked her character even though she wasn't in here that much. The finale of this film was awesome. Like, I had a lot of fun with the action sequences they had in this film, but the one that really blew me away was the finale. The finale was just fantastic. The finale was how I really wanted the rest of the film to be. Like, it, it just felt like the storyline developed a little bit better when the finale was there, and 
they also play the classic Lone Ranger theme song in the finale. And I think that's what made it really awesome. The fact that one song was playing as the action was going. And it was awesome. I was so blown away. It was the best part of the whole film in my opinion. I also did kind of enjoy the ending too because it did bring a call back from the Lone Ranger TV show. So I thought that was... Pretty cool how they ended The Lone Ranger. I am very disappointed in this film. I was actually this close to giving it a pretty bad rating. But thinking about the amount of good moments and thinking about the amount of unwatchable and bad moments in this film. I think it's an overall okay film. It is going to get a lot of hate. I am going to give the disappointing western film The Lone Ranger... Two out of four stars. <sighs> Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Subscribe to my channel. Comment below and give me your opinion of the film. Like and share this video. I will always have Taga Power!